Hi, my name is Kesar Alam. I'm a trainer and supervisor at SIAB's Mental Health Hotline, and I'm also a psychiatric researcher and a counselor in training. So I'd like to talk a little bit about self-soothing in relationships. Self-soothing is the idea that I have the ability to both recognize and calm my emotion without just depending on my partner. And so what that looks like is when, say that there's a conflict between a husband and wife and um, the husband is just unavailable for, for either providing reassurance or soothing the wife's emotion. If the wife is just simply dependent on the husband, it is going to further complicate, either cause her to withdraw or get more angry. So it can really drive a conflict further deeper. If a person is able to self-soothe themselves, bring them themselves down, it can, be, it, it can help process the couple's issues in a more um, in, in a way that it's less destructive than it may have to be otherwise. If I am completely dependent on my partner, then I'm just going to be, you know, I could get really angry that I, they're just not soothing my emotion. So it's also really about taking responsibility for your emotion. And that's the second thing I'd like to talk about. Um, being an agent of your own emotion, that means taking responsibility for one's own emotions. And what does that look like? So for example, if I say something like, he always makes me feel so worthless, or she always makes me feel this way. I'm not taking responsibility or ownership of my feelings, which belong to me. And reframing that can actually help me control my emotion. At least it can first provide me that this is in my control and it is within me. Because if, some, if, if the control of my emotions is always outside of me, the, the control of my suffering is always outside of me, I'm going to be helpless. I'm going to be helpless in my mental health. I'm not going to be able to choose. I'm not going to be able to choose a path of my own. And that can be really empowering, realizing that this is my emotion, this is what I'm feeling. Self-soothing can mean anything for, for, for anyone. It can mean going to a therapist, talking to a friend, drawing, um, meditating, anything that helps me be aware of my emotion and see the process, see what it needs. Does it need calming? Does it need examining? And um, it is an empowering process to be able to do that. And that is a power, a self-worth that you can bring into a relationship as well. So, so that it doesn't add a further layer of difficulty in whatever problem one may have in, within a relationship.